Desalinization is an increasing cause for concern, both globally and for farmers and water managers in the low-lying areas of the Netherlands. Over the coming decades, we can expect the problem to increase in such coastal areas, making it impossible to use groundwater and surface water for irrigation and drinking. Climate change in combination with sea level rise and land subsidence are the main causes. Salinization can cause enormous damage to crops and drinking water reserves, so water managers and farmers need to take timely action to prevent or at least limit the damage. I am Marta Faneca Sanchez, an hydrogeologist working at Deltares. Together with a team of international researchers, I have developed a new method for improving the forecast of fresh water distribution below the surface. We use groundwater models based on electromagnetic measurements taken from the air. This enables water managers and farmers to take better decisions about when and where they need to intervene to prevent damage. With a new method, electromagnetic field surveys using an helicopter, we can map out the salt concentrations of an entire area at a specific moment. And this means you have a good starting point to calculate the various climate scenarios so you can take the appropriate and most sustainable measures in good time. Over a period of one week, an helicopter flew over an area measuring 900 square kilometers. The electromagnetic equipment registered the electrical resistivity of the subsurface. The resulting data was visualized in a 3D picture showing salt concentrations and was adopted as the basis for calculating the effects of climate change on the groundwater system in the north of the Netherlands. The data density and quality improve with this method and you can also collect data faster than with traditional methods. It is an efficient way for mapping out salinization problems and making forecasts so that farmers and water managers can take appropriate decisions. And not just in the Netherlands, but also in other deltas throughout the world. 